is up guys new tech begins here today we are going to install the filmix rom onto the lg g6 let's just have a look uh, at the software information this is the filmix 4.0 which is upgradable with the filmix over the air to 4.1 4.2 it's got android 7.0 LG V11L, Filmix tweaks, this is a stock kernel, full UX 6.1. You can also use Magisk or SuperSU to root. It's got the Google Assistant. Alright, let's try the Google Assistant. What is the weather in San Francisco? Currently in San Francisco it's 13 degrees and mostly cloudy. Today, it will be partly cloudy, with a forecast high of 16 and a low of 11. Well, that is really nice. Alright, just in a second. Okay, clear. Those things here. Alright. So, this room looks uh, really nice. It's a uh, stock room of the LG G6 and it's got already root pre-installed okay so let's go ahead and let's check the root got already the magisk manager installed uh, go to root checker and let's try to verify the root to see if congratulations root access is properly installed on this device this is the LG H870 Android version 7.0. Alright, so this ROM can be installed on the H870 and it can also be installed on the US 997. You need also a bootloader to install it, so two files. I will put the link in the video description below where you can download the files. If we have a look at the home screen, get this standard screen, which is this one here. But we can also change it into something else. If we select the home, we can do this home here like this. Home screen, we also have the possibility to do easy home. Let's have a look and see how that looks. Alright, so that looks also nice. Um, we've got three different home options. Alright. Let's go back to our standard home and app drawer. This one here. Looks good, okay. If we go to software update, you see new update available 4.1. Tap to download, okay, let's try it. Download. This will fix the camera mode. Ready to install. Yes, okay. Good. rebooting and from there we can also go into the 4.2 let's try it also so we can go here. and it's running automatically okay now we will reboot again now let's see if we can do the whole time 4.2 looks amazing Wait, all right, just bear with me a second. I'm going to try to go to settings again. Let's check here the version of the software update 4.2. You see, automatically now it's enabled the over the air update. So let's go ahead and let's download 4.2 and let's install that. It's a fixed LG face unlock option. Alright, and we 
Hit uninstall, okay. It will do his thing automatically. It will go into twerp automatically and then it will install the patch 4.2 that will reboot automatically. So now let me just show you how to install this ROM. First of all you want to make a backup, a full backup of your phone. So let's power off the phone. Now you want to boot into twerp. To go into twerp you want to hold down the volume down button. This one here and power on the system at the same time. And then when you see the LG logo you release the power button and repress the power button. Okay, so let's do that. Going down, power, release the power button and repress the power button. If we give this screen here, factory data reset, press once or twice this button here until it goes to yes, and hit on the power button again, go to yes, the power button. And now you will have the twerp. So first of all you want to make the backup. First things first. Just go ahead and make a backup of everything. And select storage using here the micro SD card. So let's go ahead and select that, hit on OK and swipe to backup. I already made it. So okay, so after you have made the backup, you want to go ahead and install the ROM. Uh, very important, you have to uh, use two files, which is the Filmix ROM and the H870 bootloader. Otherwise it will loop boot, it will continuously boot uh, and that will not work. So you will need the Fomix ROM and depending on the phone you have you will need the H817 or the US 997 bootloader. Alright so first wipe the phone, let's go ahead and swipe the factory reset. Start from scratch. You want to go back, go to advanced wipe, and select the five first options: Dalvik, hard cache, system data, internal storage, and cache. And let's go ahead and swipe to wipe. When that is done, go back, go back, hit on format data, and type in yes. This will format the data and then we go back, go back again, go back again. And now it's time to hit on install. Let's install the two files at the same time, which is the Filmix ROM 4.0, add a zip file, which is the bootloader for Filmix ROM. Select your proper device bootloader and swipe to flash. will bring up the aroma installer which looks really nice it's very user friendly just hit the next button go to installation you got the H870 international model if you have the US 997 go ahead and select that one select your proper model and click on next you can choose for the root if you want to use Magisk or the Super Shoe. Use one at a time. Alright, we are going to use the Magisk. Hit on next. You can select the apps which you 
don't want to install so which you want to uninstall install everything and go ahead and hit on next we add also the viper the headphones app calculator smart monitors and the old themes hit on next select the region the fixed gps the server google hit on next and install now just wait patiently, this will extract and install all the files. Alright, so after the ROM has been installed, go ahead and tap on next reboot your device now so click on finish please wait and that will reboot the system so let's see what that will leave Alright, now it has finished to install the phone. Select your language and hit on next. Skip the SIM card for now. Skip the MRFI for now. Let's go ahead and choose all the options and hit on next. Go ahead and type in the name. Today you saw how we can install the Filmix ROM uh, version 4.0 which is upgradable to 4.1 and 4.2. This ROM is a nice stock uh, ROM. The stock kernel LGV11L, it's got the full UX 6.1 interface, it's got some nice Filmix tweaks, it's got also the Filmix over the air, and for the root. If this video was helpful for you, consider to subscribe, so later you won't miss any new videos that I'm going to upload for now thank you for watching stay well peace out